Hi Libra, welcome to your today's love reading. This is Chelsea. Thank you so much for subscribing to my channel. I really appreciate your love and support and I hope all is well with everyone. And Libra, please bear in mind that this reading will not resonate with each and every one of you. Time is an illusion in tarot, so this reading could resonate with you in the past, currently, or in the future. Okay Libra, let's get your reading started. Spirits and angels, please show me important accurate love messages for Libra today. Please show me more. Uh, let's see one more. Okay. Libra, please bear in mind that roles can be reversed in this reading. Could either be it could either be you or your person you are thinking about or dealing with. Eight of Pentacles in reverse. Does this energy somebody from your past where you've, you're not focusing on anymore? Perhaps you could have let them go. With the King of Cups here, you could have been dealing with a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. I'm also seeing Aries, um, Sagittarius, Leo. Can be any sign, okay? Aquarius, pretty, pretty strong Aquarius as well, and Virgo. Okay, so with the Fool here, I feel like Libra, a lot of you are no longer fighting for this past relationship or this past person but it does look like your past person could be watching you um for me the fool has something to do with freedom liberating yourself from a situation freeing yourself from somebody but also it could mean starting a new journey in love and we've also got the six of cups in reverse an indication of you perhaps having really bad memories memories in regards to your past person here and the high priestess is right here. I feel like you are, uh, you ha you are very psychic, <laughs> Libra. Actually, I feel like a lot of you, um, right now at this moment, I feel like you have um, very heightened intuition. Okay, and also we've got the moon here. Also could indicate intuition, but secrets, mystery, perhaps fear and anxiety about the unknown about future when it comes to your love a love situation or love life in the future and also i've got the star here uh, libra i feel like a lot of you are on your way to healing if and if you are on your way to healing you will be successful um and you know it'd be a successful healing you know you never know that people can't heal after even 10 years but i feel like you're going to be successful and um, with the six of wands here also, I feel like some of you, you could have started already a new relationship. If not, then it's coming your way. It almost looks like it's somebody you've always wished for and somebody who actually looks at you, you know, like, oh, like, look at you like you're the star, like you're the celebrity, or you're the one that they've always wished for. They definitely look up to you. Um, and with the Six of Wands here, they find you very, very attractive. And maybe they also see you as having a lot of options. It's a once year find, finding you extremely um, attractive. Have I already said that? Um, and <laughs> this is a male phallic symbol as well with Ace of Wands. Every time when they look at you, especially when you're not wearing any clothes, <laughs> that's when they feel like, mm, you know, <laughs> this, let's keep it PG-13 here. But we've got the Nine of Cups here, Libra. It looks like whatever you've been wishing for, it's it looks like it's going to come true as well, okay? Um, could be a new love, somebody whom, again, that you are very attracted to, and vice versa, and we've got the Ace of Cups in reverse. This is another new beginning that I feel like this could be your past person because I'm connecting the King of Cups and the Ace of Cups here. Perhaps this is somebody from your past. I feel like on a download with the Hermit in reverse, you could be wondering what's going on with your past person, all that. Um, again, it could go vice versa, but then Ace of Cups in reverse, it could be a delay, someone could be expecting an offer in love or an offer in an apology, offer in, hey, can we start over? But it looks like it hasn't happened yet or that there is a delay here. But the home in reverse could also indicate, Libra, that you've learned your lessons from your past. And Ace of Cups in reverse could also indicate you're turning down a love offer. Perhaps you don't think that it is sincere or it's not what you want. Or you just like kind of not a, a trust. There are trust issues here, okay? Libra, this is actually your energy, Queen of Swords in reverse. I feel like you still definitely are harboring a lot of um, resentments 
or grudges towards your past person here. They could have lied because, you know, I do sense like some secrets that they were hiding or that, that they were keeping. Uh, with the sword being down could mean, you know, communication that is not truthful. Um, I feel like you could be feeling very um, still on the down low, very upset with them, okay? You may not be talking about that anymore. You may be keeping quiet now, but I feel like deep down, you still have a lot of resentments towards your past person here. You haven't forgotten yet, that's for sure. And you're remembering all the bad things they did to you, okay? All right, let's see a little bit more, Libra. Okay, so you got a will of fortune in reverse. So this is a stuck energy. For some of you could be feeling kind of stuck or feeling like, why am I so unlucky right now or unlucky in love? Um, it could be general as well, okay? And the charity, I feel like a lot of you are moving towards victory, okay? If everything seems like kind of like a mystery or that you have fear, not knowing what the outcome is going to be when it comes to your love or your life, um, it looks like it's going to be very successful here. I do sense that everything that you've been hoping for, it looks like it's going to come true. And the judgment is here as well. So I feel like the judgment has something to do with if anyone was hiding any secrets, okay, maybe your past person, uh, it will be revealed eventually. For some of you, for a lot of you, it has already been revealed. And this is why you do not want to look back because whatever that was being revealed is kind of, it's very ugly, okay? And also, this could mean the judgment card for me. Also, it means karma, okay? Uh, okay. Also, I'm sensing Libra. Everyone has karmic debts, right? I feel like you're about to finish paying off your karmic debt. It looks like um, the world is going to be a better place for you, okay? If, sooner or later. So... Ace of Wands, I feel it's a new beginning. Yeah, again, this new beginning that I feel could be with somebody completely new. But, you know, judgment could also indicate reconciliation. Someone from the past may want to return and reconcile for some of you, okay? We've got the Four of Swords here. May want to reignite this passion with you. May want to move forward towards you because now they see you are more attractive than even like before. Um, but for some of you, yeah, but for a lot of you, Libra, I feel like this could be somebody new. But with the four swords here, I feel like you're just taking a break. Uh, you have a lot, you think a lot. I feel like there's, there's a lot of thinking here. A bit, it's almost like um, worries as well. Praying and hoping and wishing. But it does look like it's going to come true. Nine of Cups is also here. So it's a wish fulfillment card. You may be feeling stuck right now. But it looks like everything is going to open up for you, all right? Uh, Libra, this is your reading. I hope you resonated. If you did, please hit like, share, and subscribe. Currently, I am accepting personal reading requests. My information is in the description box below if you'd like to book me, if nothing else. Hope to see you tomorrow as I've been posting videos almost every single day lately. Take care, Libra. Bye.